The following is a non-profit fan vice parody. Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, and Dragon Ball GT are all owned by Funimation, Toei Animation, Fuji TV, and Okira Toriyama. Please support the official release. And so I tell him, I don't care who you are. Now clean my jowls. And that was Nail's first day on the job. Yes, sir. I remember I was there. That also doesn't have anything to do with what we were talking about. What were we talking about? That ungodly power headed our way! Oh yeah, that. You know, perhaps you should give someone else that power up? You remember the one you gave the Earthlings? You are correct. It is time for me to unlock your hidden powers. Dende. Oh, what the heck? And now, your power has been awakened. I noticed. Sir, I was referring to me! Now listen to me, Dende. With these powers, you garner a huge responsibility. I need you to run as fast as you can to the Earthling. Sir, he left you the moment after you gave him the power up. That slot! It is a thing! Out of nowhere, this stupid guy in this stupid outfit starts beating us up and I lost me best mind and- Jace! <sighs> You'll speak to me professionally and dutifully. Oh, um, sorry, kitten. Now, Jace, back from the field. Full report. Well, see, at first it was going fine, but next thing we know, Galdo, well... Oh, Lord, he's dead, isn't he? Dead he is, sir. Well, in our line of work, our lives can be compromised at any moment. This is something we must live with. On the plus side, Bird owes me 50 rabbits. About that, Captain. He's probably not gonna pie up. Really? He's usually such a good sport about that. Thing is, he's come down with a sudden case of death, sir. Oh. That's... wow. That's a rather hefty loss. Yes, sir. He was a valued teammate. Strong, fast, and... And blue! Pardon, kitten? Blue! And tall! And you're so red! And short! It was the perfect little yin-yang thing we had going. Not that short, kitten. Oh, don't go all Vegeta on me. Now, where are we going to find another blue recruit? Perhaps Recruit knows someone. <sighs> He's dead too, isn't he? Yeah. Well... Did he at least die with dignity? Define dignity, sir. Uh, well, Jace, I believe the next step is obvious. We, as professionals, cannot allow this act to go unabated. We have a job to finish, and we shall see it through. Yes, sir! Can you force? Away! Sure is nice to see you guys again. But I sure can't help but feel that someone's missing. Oh yeah, Bulma! What do you think she's up to? Probably something girly. Like her hair. Your idiotic banter is charming, but if you haven't noticed, we're pretty much screwed here. What? Why? Frieza has the Dragon Balls, you dolt, which basically means we're already dead. Actually, not really. Oh? Something you know that I don't? A lot of things, actually. You have five seconds to rephrase that. Four. Three. Actually, what I meant to say was, when you make a wish on the Dragon Balls, the sky turns darker than the blackest void. Hmm? And out of the balls rises a giant dragon. So yeah, none of that. Two. One. Hi, Vegeta. Hi, Ginyu. Ugh. That's him, Kitten! That's the one who beat us up! What? Just look at his hair! He looks like he just got out of the bed! For goodness sakes, Jace, he's even wearing pajamas! I swear it, sir! He picked us apart one by one! We never stood a chance- <laughs> Oh! So oh, that's just your dare! Jace, what have I told you? You know, I'm surprised you're here, Ginyu. I thought you'd be busy polishing Frieza's boots. First off, Lord Frieza doesn't wear boots. Second, if he did, I'd have already polished them. Third, he's off chasing some leftover Namekians. Wait, so Frieza's not at the ship? Correct. And you're here? That's right. And the average power level of Frieza's soldiers is... 2,000. Interesting. Krillin, Gohan, get out of here and find Bulma. Vegeta and I can handle this on our own. Oh no, I mean I'd really hate to leave you on your own, you know, but if you say so, let's go, Gohan! Be careful, Dad! 
Alright, Vegeta. We have to put our differences aside for now, and take these guys as a team. Yeah, that's fantastic and entertaining and all that. But first, if you don't mind me, I need to use the restroom. Oh, okay. About a hundred miles away. He has a very nervous bladder. <laughs> So, for the first century, I'll go easy on them, lure them into a false sense of security, and then when they think I'm not so bad, BAM! I'll go full tyrant on them in the second century. After that, I'll disappear for a millennia and make them wonder if I ever existed to begin with, just to come back and kill them all. Good afternoon. It's morning. Attack. Cute kid. Seems familiar. What do you want? Ah, good sir. I suppose you could say I'm looking for technical support. No. Do we have a visitor? Yes, sir. No. Take his coat. I don't have a coat. He doesn't have a coat, sir. And I believe this is the man who basically killed our entire race. No. Don't take his coat. You see, I recently acquired what you people refer to as Dragon Balls, but I'm having trouble getting them to do what I want. Did you try working the shaft? Classy. Now, what does he want? He's asking how to use the Dragon Balls. Did you tell him to work the shaft? Yes, Lord Guru. Good work, Now. I have the distinct impression you're going to be difficult. Well, sir, if you're having a problem with our customer support, you can call 1-800-EAT-A- we don't even have those! Okay, this is getting ridiculous. What is that? Oh, God! Natural light! Good Lord, I was led to believe your species survived entirely on water. How is he so fat? Oh, hello. I'm Super Kami Guru, and I'm the guy who's not judging you on your appearance. Well, my name is Frieza, ruler of most of the known galaxy. I'm here to offer you a deal. You give me the information I require, and I'll let the sporting young man live. Please. Nail isn't afraid of you. He is the strongest of our race. Oh, really? Ah, uh, sir? Yeah, Nail's gonna destroy your sorry ass. They wouldn't be able to air it on the news because it'll be so brutal. Sir, seriously? Hush, Nail. I'm speaking for you. Well then, if this is the only course of action available to me, I accept. I'll dispatch of this worm, and then I'll be back for you, slug. Leave my brother out of this. Sir, his power is overwhelming. I can also sense it's only a fraction of what he's capable of. Nail, listen to me. You are Namek's number one son, a prodigy child. You have been trained in the ancient ways. I believe in you. You mean that, Lord Guru? Yes, Nail. Now show him the staggering spirit of Namek, and waste his smug ass. Yes, sir! Follow me! Fool. If I had trained him in the new way, he might have stood a chance. <laughs> You have an interesting form and a surprisingly well-held technique. And you're purple! I'm sufficiently impressed. You've held your own very well. But your form and grace will never compare to that of the illustrious Captain Ganyu! You mean like this? Oh god, is that what I look like? Jace, that isn't what I look like, is it? No, Captain, you look amazing! No offense, but this is boring. Like, really boring. Like, listening to Gohan's piano recital boring. I realize these poses in an effort to invigorate my men and raise morale. How dare you mock them! Well, I mean, it's just, I'm not even using half my power right now. Ha! Ah, quite a substantial bluff. But a bluff and nothing more. I've witnessed your abilities firsthand, and I assure you that you're... <laughs> A hundred and eighty thousand! Huh. Oi, Keaton! Isn't your max power level only one hundred and- <laughs> Yeah, one hundred and twenty thousand. That's what I thought. Is he gonna be okay? Hey, the Keaton? Yeah, he just does that sometimes. <laughs> Alright, I'm back. How you going, Keaton? How do you think? 
Well, Kitten, if you're getting stressed, you could always, you know. Oh, jeez. This is hardly the time or the place. Besides, I did it in the pod on the way here. Uh, I meant switch bodies, sir. Ah, yes, of course. Hold my scouter. Hey, what are you doing with your head? <laughs> um, sir, you're supposed to do that to me. Oh, but you see, I did do it to you. I don't understand. Take no! <laughs> oh, wow. What happened? Everything seems weird. Oh, hey, there's another me over there. I wonder if... Ah! Oh, my chest! What in the... Oh! 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 oh. Hey, Boba! We're back! How are you doing? I bought a giant crab! They make a special shampoo for that, I hear. Ow! What happened? I'm all purple and horny. Chi-Chi's gonna hate this. What's mine is yours, and yours is mine, as they say. G give me back my body! I'm sorry, you can't have your body anymore. It's mine now. Jace, shall we? Right, kitten. Goodbye! Enjoy bleeding to death. I won't! Man. I'm a jerk now. The radar says we're getting close. Yeah, who would have thought Bulma would have been so compliant? Why? Why would you leave me alone here? I don't know this place. Did you know there are giant crabs down there? I do. I killed one. Okay, Bulma, let's just calm down. Why are you upset? Why? Because I am always alone. Okay, Bulma, if we were to stay here, what would that accomplish? Just take the fucking radar. Thank you, Bulma. Say thank you, Gohan. Thank you, Bulma. No problem, Gohan. And no problem. Shove it. I'll take it. Let's go! Well, if you ask me, all she needs is a little bit of wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Still five. Right. It's called the Wilhelm scream, man. It's like the one in Star Wars where the stormtrooper falls. Oh, uh, yeah, I love that scream. Uh, doesn't it sound like... <laughs> nah, dude, it's more like... Ah! No, that wasn't it either. Ah! the body, sir? Fantastic. A little too pink and hairy in odd places, but I'll grow into it. So, what's the plan, kitten? Well, first off, we have to touch on Freeze's balls. Uh, sir... Yes, yes, realized the moment I said it. Alright, get your act together. Hundred times gravity? That's for pussies. The only reason he took those jokers out was because I loosened them up for him. Like a jar of space pickles. Ugly, stupid space pickles. I just gotta get those Dragon Balls. And if it's anything like that jockstrap incident, then you probably buried them somewhere around here. Hey, Gohan! I think they're buried somewhere around here! Well, at least I'll have something to put back in the hole. Dig like there's no tomorrow! Okay, the second they summon the dragon, I'll swoop in and break the bald one's neck. Totally gonna yell Team Three Star when I do it, too. Oh, I can see it now. Team Three Star! Ow! Amazing. We found them! Krillin, we really did it! Finally! Now let's hurry up and wish back Piccolo, Tian Jin Han, and Chaozu! What about Yamcha? What about Yamcha? I don't know what this Yamcha is, but it sounds just like Raditz. Eternal Dragon! Rise up and grant our wish! <laughs> It's not working. Is that what you're supposed to say? Honestly, that's always been pretty vague. Usually just gather them together and then out pops the magic dragon. Maybe there's something special about Namekian Dragon Balls. Huh. Maybe if I sing to it. I know a song that gets on everybody's nerves! Actually, Krillin, I was thinking something else. Maybe the only way to summon it is to call it in its native language. I don't speak German! And the only person I know who does was the toilet. And it's dead. God rest his seat. Uh, what? Oh, you can't be serious. Huh? Hey, Krillin, I feel two power levels coming this way. You don't think my dad failed, do you? No way, Gohan! Your dad's the best! But on the off chance, hide yourself! Oi, Keaton! 
Someone's dug up the balls! Well then, someone's in for the beating of their life. Hey, Goku! Check it out! We dug up the Dragon Balls! How you doing? Did you win that fight against that Ginyu guy? Why's that Space New Zealand guy here? Ah, uh, what the What's up with the Scouter? And do you happen to know anybody who speaks German? <laughs> ah! Ah! And what was that about? Colin, that's not my dad! Gohan, of course it's your dad! Goku, what's your favorite food? Waldorf salad. See, double Baconator! Oh, shit! You see, I've acquired the body of your former associate. Goku, was it? And with that, I've gained his power level of 180,000. That's... that's horrible! Quite. I'm sure you understand now the situation you're in. That is identity theft! We're gonna sue the crap out of you! You can't sue me if I kill you. No, then you'll get put on trial for murder! Ha! <laughs> Huh? Uh, Captain? You're here! The devil are you? Oh. Well, look what the space cat regurgitated. Hey, Gohan. Hey, Krillin. Hey, Goku. D dad I'm surprised you're still kicking. How's that wound treating you? This is easily the second worst hole I've ever had in my chest. It's gonna take, like, a million mommy kisses to make it better. Gohan, we may have a chance now, but you'll have to give it your all. Remember, he may look like your dad, but you can absolutely not hold back! I'm gonna be for you with Piccolo! Send me off into space, and the next time I get to see you, you lost your dad, body. You're not even you anymore! I don't know where he gets that from. <clears throat> this is absurd! His power level was a league above my own when we fought! What the blazes is going on? Haha, <laughs> you don't know any of my techniques. What techniques? Tell me. I'm not gonna tell you how to use the Kaioken. Kaio what? Oh, oh. Jace, huh? if you're not too busy standing there like a slack-jawed idiot, I could use your help. Wait, if I'm Ginyu now, does that mean you have to listen to me? No. Oh, well then, what about him? Good day, <laughs> mate. <laughs> So, we've been flying for about 20 minutes now. Got any family? Because if so, I probably killed them. Really? Nothing to that? You're no fun. Oh, I know. How about a good old-fashioned joke? How many Namekians does it take to screw in a light bulb? Their whole race. One to screw in the light bulb and the rest to die. And then the other one dies too. Stop ignoring me. Hey Jace, I've killed every single one of Freezer's flunkies I've got up against so far. Six in total. How would you like to be number seven? Peace off, you bloody monkey! Thank you, sir. May I have another? What the hell happened to you? You were not this strong when you fought Raccoon! Looks like you have some required reading to do. Alright, let's see here. Okay, full moon, lose your tiles, stronger every time you... Oh. Well, I'm right f***ed, aren't I? Right in the down under. <laughs> Clever girl. No! Jace! All of my men. I'm the only one left. Please, all of you, just... Just allow me a customary moment of silence. <laughs> the best part about this? I get to kill both Ginyu and Kakarot at the same time! Wait, who's Kakarot? Your Kakarot. I thought his name was Goku. His name is Goku! No, it's Kakarot! But he just said Goku. Yeah, I did. I know what he said, buddy. So what is it? Kakarot or Goku? It's, it's Kakarot. Kakarot! No, no, no! Just... Look, his Saiyan name is Kakarot, but he changed it when he landed on Earth as a baby. So they kept calling him by his Earth name, and I am calling him by his real name! So does that make me Ginyu? Yes! Yes! Perfect! Change? No! 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 I'll save you, Goku! What just happened? I don't know. Yay, I'm me again. Wait, Goku, what is your favorite food? Favorite? He's him again! This is ridiculous! But at least I'm not trapped in some useless body. <laughs> Give me a minute. <laughs> 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 
So I'm confused. Ginyu took my dad's body, but then he tried to take Vegeta's body. But now he's back in his own body, my dad's back in his own body, and Vegeta's... Still a prick, yeah. Now, to switch your body to a cross! Ah, crap, kinda walked into this one. <laughs> The hell just happened? A frog got on my hand. It was gross, so I threw it. So then, is it over? Are they all gone now? They will be in a second. Vegeta, no! He can't hurt anyone anymore. Stop! Oh, all right, fine. See? You really can be a nice guy. Psychate for eight. Oh!